Cookie Swirl? See? <laughs> Hi, Cookie fans. I'm sparking with excitement because there's brand new students arriving. Here, let's take a look. That's right, Cookie fans. Frankie is right. We've got brand new students that have been added to woo, the Monster High line. And I am in love with these three ghouls. I think they're super duper cool. So let's swing on in for a closer look. All right, let's rock and troll and start meeting some of these Brand boo students. Oh, here is our first ghoul. This is Kirsty Trollson, and she is daughter of a troll. She comes all the way from Gorway. And this ghoul is definitely, definitely video game obsessed, as you can tell by her style. Look at her awesome, awesome outfit that she has. I love her super, super awesome, like beanie hat that she has that has these little horns here. It looks like a super cool knitted design. Look at that chunky, chunky cable knit. Looks super warm and toasty. She has these pixelated glasses that she wears. And if you look deep, deep, deep into her eyes, you can see that her eyes are also pixelated as well, which is perfectly fine. The world that she prefers to see is in video games. She also has these little pixelated earrings. T-shirt, check out the little sleeves too. The skirt has two levels. We've got the super pixelated little bottom layer, and then we have this really cool, like magenta shimmery metallic with a little bit of some mesh at the bottom. She knows how to play it cool with this super awesome black bangle. And look at her snuggly, snuggly shoes as well. She's got these, these really thick little socks and these pixelated little wedge boots as well. Look at how she does her laces. Oh yeah, thinking outside of the digital box. She also comes with this little diary, which I read and it's so super duper cute. Turns out that Gulia actually beat her high score <gasps> I know, which she finds absolutely impossible because she is such a good gamer, which at first she was not happy, but as it turns out in her little diary, it says that her BFF now is Gulia and Heath. I think it totally rocks that she has this controller little bag as well, which it actually does open so you can put anything you want inside of this little controller. So she can even carry around her video games with her. Totally, totally perfect. Yep, that bag definitely scores her a lot of cool points. Let's have the next ghoul fly in with her fabulousness. Oh, here she is. This is Batsy Claro, and she is daughter of the white vampire bat. She comes all the way from her home, Costa Rica, where she is a tour guide in the jungle and introducing new monsters to the beauty, beauty, beauty of the jungle. Okay, look at her hair. I love this mixture of like her white, it, her hair is like this white, white, white platinum blonde mixed in with this super bright green. I love her woven headband. You can definitely see that she gets inspiration for her style from the jungle. I love this top, how it's just completely right here at the shoulders. It looks completely woven. I love the detailing on her face too with her makeup. Look at those long, beautiful, beautiful earrings. Oh, her lips. Her lipstick are two different colors. That's way cool. She has this little white bat right here at the front of her shorts. She's got these little adorable detailing right here. One in black, one in this neon green, and then one in this pink. Super cool printed shorts because it's very, very hot in Costa Rica. So she, so she dresses nice and cool. No way, look at those shoes. Ooh, whoa, okay, they look like they were woven in and out, like literally made from plants. And I love the heel as well. These are just so, so detailed. I love the little diary that she came with because it ex explains how well she was accepted into the Monster High exchange program. But mostly she found out that someone at Monster High had stolen the rare ghost orchid while how they were taking a tour from her. So she has actually come to Monster High to get this very rare endangered flower back. So she is on a mission. She has supersonic hearing. So I'm sure as she's roaming the halls of Monster High, she will have no problem hearing at least somebody talk about this rare, rare ghost flower. She can carry some of her belongings in this super big, beautiful purse that matches her outfit and also is woven. And it has the same beautiful design as her earrings. And I love, love her wings. Also look at the detail in those as well. She's just fabulous in every way. Whew. Dancing on in next is EC Dawn Dancer. Oh, wow. She is the daughter of the deer spirit. She comes all the way in from Boo, Hexaco, and her favorite thing ever is dancing. She just absolutely loves it. She loves performing the old dance of her people. She loves her family and doesn't want to leave them. 
But a vision has brought her to Monster High, so she is here following that vision. She has gorgeous, gorgeous, long turquoisey hair. She has these little antlers right here on her headband, her cute little ears, she's got an earring. I love the little dream catcher with the little feathers on her headband. She has some necklaces on. Look at her outfit. These really beautiful, beautiful like tribal print. And look at her little fringe shoes with three layers of super fun fringe. I bet that looks beautiful when she's dancing. And her shoes even have little tiny dream catchers on them as well. And it's super cool people because she is daughter of the deer spirit. She actually has like deer feet. I love her little triangle bangles that she has on too. On both of her hands, she can get carried away with the most gorgeous bag. It's a big jumbo dream catcher that's printed on both sides. And of course she comes with her diary as well. I think these are some of my favorite dolls from Monster High. I'm really, really crazy, crazy about them. Their colors, their style, their detailing are absolutely beautiful. And same thing with their stories. I hope you cookies dance on over to my next video. I will see you there. Bye, cookie fans. fans well I'm not shocked you're at the end of the video because you were awesome how well were you paying attention to the video did you notice that one of these ghouls was holding this delicious rainbow cookie which ghoul was it was it Easy, Batsy or Kirsty put your answer below in the comments bye cookie fans